Oh my gosh, I just realized I have more rubbers in here to add to the video. Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm going to be doing a, an eraser review, or rubber review if you live in the UK. I'm not quite sure, but I always call these rubbers, but I know that can mean different things in other countries. So I'm going to try and call these erasers, but if I slip and say rubbers, you know what I mean. So without further ado, let's get started. For Christmas, I bought myself this fabulous um, uh, advent calendar. So in each one, you get a new, like a different rubber. This was, um, I think, seven fifty in the stores, but it was half price because I think it was like the second week or first week into like December. So they were like, we need to get rid of this crazy thing. We don't want it in our store anymore. On the back of this, um, there is. Uh, display but they look really bad like they don't look I think the color should be like it's too bright it looks crazy so I took a chance and was like ah oh well oh well each one in stores are normally about one pound one pound ten depending where you go 99p you're never gonna get less than that so there was 25 so that's like 25 pounds worth of rubbers and I got it for three pound 25 or four pounds something like that so first of all I'm going to go through the Christmas rubbers and then I'm gonna go through the more exciting Japanese rubbers that I have what I love about all the erasers is that all the little bits come out um, and you can put them back together and it's so much fun I don't actually use any of these for the, the purpose of being a rubber or an eraser. Um, I just love, love looking at them and I just collect them and they're just so adorable. <laughs> Some of them do look really silly, so they're like the more cheaper ones um, and that's probably why the calendar was just so cheap. But I got them anyway um, because I just, I'm obsessed with rubbers. <laughs> I don't even know what this blue thing is, it's so crazy. And this is a little tortoise with a tortoise. <laughs> Like the whole shell comes apart, so yeah, it's quite cute. So we have some dinosaur rubbers. These ones are kind of boring because they're just one solid piece and you can't really do anything with them. As opposed to the, some of the other rubbers that come apart a bit more. A little crazy random foot but it comes apart uh, and it's quite cool. We have um, a little car, a little police car. A little siren comes out and the whole body of the car comes out. So this bit is not a rubber, it's like little plastic wheels. Uh, and they come apart. I have a little train. This is not as cool, it's just one solid block. This was made in the USA. Awesome. Next up we have a little crab. Uh, I don't know what this is, maybe like a little weird thing, but just one little crab. This fish reminds me of Klaus from uh, an adult comedy show. What I like is you can change some of the characters around and you'll never know. This is a Santa Claus. I'm not sure why his face is so pink, but um, you can just take that right out and not worry about it. <laughs> so this is the rubber um, I got out of the Christmas calendar. And this is a rubber that I had to buy because I loved it. <laughs> See the comparison of just quality? The story behind me buying this calendar is um, me and my friend were Christmas shopping. I went into this uh, gift shop and they had these little rubbers. Um, and I really wanted this Santa Claus um, because I absolutely love blue and white things. Um, it's my persona's colors. Um, so I'm obsessed. I buy just literally anything that has blue on it or blue and white. Um, and then I found this little snowman and it was so cute and I had to buy it. So that was going to be like two pounds. And then I found this tree. <laughs> and then I'm going to show the advent calendar eraser box and that was going to be about three, four pounds. It was only going to be like extra two pounds to get 23 more rubbers. So I thought, why not? Let's do it. Um, but then I noticed how badly the Santa Claus looked and I had to buy this blue one, so um, I bought this one anyway. And then I noticed that they did have a sermon in the box. Um, it has the exactly the same hat and I'm realizing it's Santa. But the I didn't like it as well as the uh, actual snowman, so I bought that snowman um, as well. So um, I was already paying two pounds, and then I was ended up paying like 
four more pounds for this box and then I found a tree <laughs> I just love this Christmas tree um, so I ended up paying way more, way more than I originally intended but uh, it was worth it um, I absolutely love all these little rubbers it's so cute so going back to the um, advent calendar rubbers um, this is the tree that came with it uh, it's okay it's, it's, it's not like this one this one's really nice but hey ho Oh wow, I think this is supposed to be a gingerbread man. Um, bootleg as heck. <laughs> Let me have a little fish. His head comes out and his body comes apart. Oh, that's cool. You can eat him and then you have a skeleton. Reindeer. This is a cute little one. It's a little camera. They are all the rubbers I got from the advent calendar. And these are all the rubbers I bought at the same time, but they were all a pound each. And they are adorable. I also had this pig grabber I bought uh, ages ago. Um, I'm gonna say like three, four years ago. I could not remember. This was one of the first rubbers I ever got. Um, and it was like a pound or a pound ten, and it was so cute. Uh, so, yeah. I had an elephant, uh, but I have lost that. I have absolutely no idea where it is. And I think it only has a head or a body. It hasn't got the whole, whole chunk of it. Um, I've lost parts of it. So I got from my friend for Christmas, and they are so cute. So this one is a little bento box, and like the little um, meat comes out, and the uh, prawns and lattice, as well as the rice and whatever this is supposed to be. <laughs> it falls into my obsession with miniatures. <laughs> Um, anything small, cute, textured, realistic, I just love, so yeah. I also have another little bento box. It has more rice, uh, whatever this little thing is. Some sausages, some sauce, and some meat, I think. And some lettuce. Both bento boxes come with a little pair of chopsticks. With those two, I also got two tiny little cups. It's so adorable. You can also use some of the rubbers as props, so these two cups could be used as little props for your videos. Um, uh, they are just the right size and they're cool, even though they are squishy and they are rubbers. With that, I also have a little sushi. Um, I'm starting to think this is a bean, <laughs> or like, uh, mm, I don't know, some Japanese paste. But it also comes with rice and seaweed. I also have a little drink. So it's so cute, it's got Japanese writing on it. Um, I believe this is supposed to be like some green tea or something. Um, the lid comes off. And the bottom comes off. And it's really cute. Uh, I believe that is all uh, that I got from that pack. I could be wrong. Um, but I'm pretty sure it's all I got from that one pack. And then the other pack I bought myself, I think. Um, I'm pretty sure I bought it. My boyfriend may have bought it for me, but I'm pretty sure I saw this and picked it up when I was with him. But I don't know, he might have bought it, I'm not sure. So I have little noodles. Um, so again, this is a rubber, an eraser. But it's so adorable. Next, we have two little bottles. We have an orange bottle of orange juice or orange uh, soda, and the lid comes off. Uh, so it's really cool. If you did use this rubber, you can use it as a proper like pen rubber, proper sized rubbing erasing out. Uh, and then we also have the same but a uh, grape version.
cute Japanese erasers. Um, let me know in the comments if you have any of these or if there are ones that I have not got and you think I should add to my collection. So let me know if you have them, maybe make a video and I will watch, subscribe and like if I like it. Make sure you check out my other videos and as always, thanks for watching, love, comment, subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys!